Uh, wrestling alternate commentary has a question. He says, what was your reaction, Arn, to the Titus O'Neil greatest Royal Rumble moment when he slips and falls and slides oh. under the ring in Saudi Arabia? Oh. <laughs> well, number one, if it, underneath that ring, if his head would have hit one of those center posts, mm. he would have torn the whole ring down. The guy is a physical beast. But that move, him sliding probably three or four yards on his belly and disappearing out of sight, is classic Titus. I, I haven't laughed so hard at anything. Once we saw that he wasn't dead, and he crawled back out from under the ring. Man, I don't ever remember laughing that hard at anything. This is live TV. And, and buddy, you said once you saw he wasn't dead, he was going so fast that if that, like you said, the support under the ring would have been in the wrong place, he could have been seriously hurt. Well, you and I have been paralyzed. Oh, absolutely. I don't know that if he, with him, big, thick, I mean, he was a physical beast. Yeah. Trust me. I mean, just like, just, I don't know that he wouldn't have torn the ring down. Man. When, when she saw he wasn't hurt, it was hilarious, and I love that the announcers just let it go, and they just had fun with it, and uh, it is one of those times that and those memories that people will never forget. Everybody remembers that. Any kind of wrestling fan remembers that. Oh, yeah. Good stuff. All right, Gavin's up next, and we're going old school here. We're talking Midnight's. Of course you worked with Bobby, Dennis, and Stan with the Midnight's and Crockett, but do you have any stories about the forgotten Midnight Express member, Norvell Austin, from your time in Fuller's territory? Um, they were leaving as I was getting there. Okay. So, I mean, there might have been a couple of weeks that they were there, and, you know, I didn't get to, didn't get to know them very much at all. Uh, it's just one of those situations where, literally, I bet there was two weeks and I was there, and two weeks they were gone. So there you go. So basically, hi and bye to Norvell, and our moved on, and that was it. No other memories, Gavin.